Well, uh, I honestly didn't expect myself to start that well. Um, it was uh, nine games in a row, six love, three love, and uh, I think it was just a matter of time when, when James will win his first game. And I knew that the reaction of the crowd and his own reaction will be the way it was. And, you know, obviously he's him as a home home player, uh, you know, uh, enjoyed a lot of support today, um, especially when he won his first game. That's when the energy, you know, kind of shifted on his side and he felt um, huge relief, obviously, winning the first game. On the other hand, I maybe dropped my concentration a bit and, uh, you know, the second set was quite close. Um, maybe could have capitalized on some opportunities in 4-3 and Love 40, but credit to him for serving well. I think that's that that made a difference for him, um, the second part of the second set. And also for most of the third set, he, in important moments, uh, managed to hit some good angles with the, with the first serves. Um, but uh, you know, the first part of the match was was uh, almost flawless. So I'm, I'm I'm very pleased with the way I've started uh, Wimbledon. Uh, well, I tried to take the best from the past. Um, tried to remember those those nice moments, and uh, thankfully there were plenty of those nice moments on the tennis court in the last couple of years uh, here in London, uh, Wimbledon particularly, and and also you know in many other tournaments. So um, trying to take uh, carry that you know. Confidence and sensations into every every next tournament that I that I play on and um, and participate on. Um, obviously, it was very emotional. Um, a couple of weeks in Paris that ended with um, with the triumph on on on, on Sunday a couple of weeks ago, and uh, I didn't have too much time to really reflect on that. But I was very pleased to be able to share that with the close ones. And uh, tennis schedule is such that. Um, it requires from you the immediate uh, focus uh, on the next tournament. Uh, literally after a week or, or so, I had to start training and getting myself in shape for grass. So, uh, And in the meantime, I also did a few things with the restaurant as well. <laughs> we recently opened, so I was quite busy. But, you know, I, uh, I'm very obviously grateful to, to, to live the life that I have. You know, I've always dreamed of playing tennis and being successful in it uh, and enjoying it, enjoying my time on tour. So I can't complain, you know, um, there, there are worse things in life.